Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I just want to share with you guys a skincare range that I have been loving and I wanted to share it with you guys because I have noticed some phenomenal results with these products and I thought I'd just give you guys a quick blurb on each of the product as well. And the range is Peter Thomas Roth and I've actually come across Peter Thomas Roth um, because I was looking for a product that had glycolic uh, in them, um, in the actual product. And so that's how I came across uh, the Peter Thomas Roth range. And if you're somebody who is very into skincare and you've done your research about glycolic acid, then you know that glycolic acid is great for aging skin or if somebody, if you're someone who is looking to prevent aging and to prolong the youthfulness of your skin, then uh, glycolic acid is your best friend because it helps with pore minimization and fine lines and wrinkles and oiliness and breakouts. It's just great for everything and it's great for somebody who has um, problems with if you have issues with cell turnover on your face or you have congestion on your skin. I highly recommend you look into purchasing um, some sort of cleansing product with uh, glycolic acid in it and the uh, since we're talking about glycolic the, the first um, thing that I actually purchased from the range was actually this toner here and it is the Peter Thomas Roth glycolic acid 10% toning complex it's a clarifying toner and it um, removes all of the dead skin cell on your face like I said and I use this with a um, cotton pad and I just moisten the cotton pad with this um, product and then I just um, work it into my face. Um, it is a little bit stinging or it actually does leave a stinging sensation if you're new to using glycolic. Uh, when I first started using glycolic I was like oh my gosh it's like burning my face what is this? But you know what after a while um, maybe a few months into the um, into using it you actually don't feel the sensation anymore it starts to reside reside and you don't actually feel any sort of burning or tingling anymore and I'm so immune to the stinging that I don't feel it anymore so I think I could probably amp up the 10% to like a 15% but as of right now I'm pretty happy with the 10% and the benefits that it has brought to my skin so far and for this one here I bought it at the Sephora here in Vancouver and it is a this thing here was $48 or $46, $46 Canadian and um, it lasts me about a year and it is an amazing product. If you're looking, if you have oily acne prone skin, I highly recommend uh, this toner for real. It just is amazing. It's so good. It's so clarifying. Like if I don't use this product or if I skip it, um, if I'm traveling and I don't want to bring this whole thing with me, I'm too lazy to put it in a travel um, container, I really do miss it. I miss the, the way that it makes my, fin, uh, my skin feel um, so clean and just, you know, it it just feels, it feels like I'm missing something in my skincare um, regimen at night if I'm not using this product. The next uh, two products I want to share with you guys are the cleansing gels. And I've actually used the glycolic cleansing gel as well. And it is the clear color cleansing gel. Um, that one actually is a great cleansing gel if you have severely acne, um, acne prone skin and you, you break out a lot. Um, it is very drying though. That one is actually very, very drying. So you have to be cognizant of making sure that you uh, moisturize your skin very, very well after using it because it actually leaves your skin very, very parched. So I don't recommend using it very often. Maybe if you are not so acne prone skin, but you have oily skin, probably use it once or twice a week instead and then just alternate it between these two cleansers. Um, so this cleanser here is the Peter Thomas Roth Rose Stem Cell Bio Repair Cleansing Gel. And it is the um, one that illuminates your skin with five perfect reparative rose stem cells um, rose stem cells and it is such out of the three uh, Peter Thomas Roth cleansers this one probably is the most moisturizing and it smells the best uh, they all have nice scents to them but this is probably the best one it does smell like rose but it doesn't smell like an old grandma's perfume or anything like that it just has a very nice elegant rose uh, scent and the color is pink and how can you not like anything that's pink 
Um, and this one was 46 Canadian dollars. It's great um, for just nighttime cleansing. I don't use any of these cl uh, cleansers for the morning cleansing. I just use a foaming cleanser for morning time uh, with the, uh, um, with one of my, I forgot what it was called, but I, I don't use the Clarisonic in the morning. I actually use uh, the Clarisonic and the cleansing gels at night. And the next one is the Peter Thomas Roth Anti-Aging Cleansing Gel. And this is the orange one. And this is infused with vitamin C, I believe. And it just helps with um, cell turnover as well. Most of their products actually have glycolic in them. So that's perfect if you're new to using glycolic acid. And this one helps with anti-wrinkle. It rejuvenates, brightens, clarifies. Um, it also has salicylic acid as well as glycolic in this one as well. This is my actual backup of uh, this one here. I've used a full-size one before and it's really, really good. It's probably a, a little bit stronger than this one but a little bit less intense than the glycolic, um, the glycolic cleansing gel, so the clear one. So it's a happy medium between the glycolic and this one. And I really, really like this one. I don't have a, in terms of like major cleansing, I would probably prefer the glycolic one, but just for everyday cleansing and just if you're somebody who's just looking for a really, really good cleanser, I would recommend this one. It definitely brightens your skin as well. And with all of the cleansers, I use it with this awesome thing right here. Um, this can probably turn any cheap cleanser into an awesome cleanser, but I just use a pea sized amount of the product into, I just pour a pea sized amount onto my Clarisonic and it just emulsifies it beautifully. Um, one bottle probably lasts me maybe six months and I use this with my Clarisonic on my chest my neck and my arms due to this little scar here and I absolutely love it. I love all of their products. Um, they again just you know live up to the claims and they're amazing. So if you're somebody who's looking for um, something new and something that is um, if you're looking for something in that is, you know, contributing towards your aging skin, I would recommend the PTR brand for sure. Um, and the last thing I want to share with you guys is uh, I actually got uh, one of their samples in my Christmas stocking stuffer. And when I used it in January, I was hooked. And I told myself I had to purchase the full size once I was out of the um, actual sample size. And the sample size was actually a generous amount. Um, but if you actually live in Vancouver, you can't purchase the full five uh, five ounce uh the five ounce tub in the store. You actually have to purchase it online and have it shipped to your home. If you do purchase it in store, it actually comes in a trio and it comes with the rose gel uh, mask and the cucumber mask um, and then the pumpkin enzyme mask as well. Um, and this one is such an amazing product. It smells so yummy and you'd be so tempted to actually eat this thing, but it's not edible, so don't eat it. But this is actually a skin resurfacer and it is the pumpkin enzyme mask enzymatic dermal uh, resurfacer. Three-in-one intensive skin resurfacer treatment exfoliates with pumpkin enzyme, peels with alpha hydroxy acid, polishes with aluminum oxide, re reveals smoother, younger looking and younger looking radiant and revitalized skin. Well, that was a mouthful, wasn't it? <laughs> but yeah, this thing is amazing because um, how you actually use it is you just make sure that you cleanse your skin as per usual and then you would just take um, a little bit of this onto your fingertips and then just um, distribute it all over your face and then you would start to massage it into your face in circular motions but make sure that your fingertips are wet so just you know put it under the sink and then start um, massaging it all over your face and then there are little granules in there but they are so small and there's so much of them so you definitely feel like you're helping you know exfoliate all that dead skin cell off and it does sting a little bit but I mean the stinging feeling will subside after a few minutes and once it does you just leave it on there for three to seven minutes but if you're like me you don't just leave it on for three to seven minutes I usually just leave it on there for 20 minutes to half an hour you know and I just find some chores to do around the house and then once I'm ready to hop into the shower I would then rinse it off and if my skin, I feel, if I feel like my skin needs to pick me up in the middle of the week or at the end of the week, then I definitely pick this up and I put it on my face. And it, 
once you wake up in the morning, I feel like that's the test of all masks is once you wake up in the morning and you look at your skin and if it's, you know, it's more brighter and, you know, not as dull and your, your pores are tight, then that's the true testament of how great the mask is. And this one here, once you wake up in the morning, your skin is absolutely flawless. So I highly recommend uh, this mask here as well. Um, and this was, I don't remember if I, I think I told you guys, but anyways, it's 67 Canadian dollars and it is freaking worth it. This thing will probably last me about a year if I interchange it between all of my other masks that I use as well. But yeah, that is um, my quick little tidbit on the Peter Thomas Roth range. It's, uh, it's a brilliant range. I would highly recommend it to anybody who's um, looking to take care of your aging skin and just making sure that your skin has a nice environment to age in and um, these products, stellar. Two thumbs up for sure. Um, anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please leave your comments and suggestions or whatever it is down below. And please subscribe to my channel if you like uh, watching these types of videos. I know that my videos aren't like the most edited and it doesn't have like the great graphics or anything like that. But I'm just a girl here wanting to share, you know, my favorite things and things that I enjoy, like, eat. And I just want to share it out there into the universe. And hopefully some of you guys can relate to me. Um, but yeah, please subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.